Welcome back for episode two of Let's Play Enchanted Arms. This is Carl, and we're in plus one channel. So, I hope that you join me for episode one, because this is an interesting game. Uh, developed by From Software, and uh, published here in America by Ubisoft. It's kind of a very poorly received game. It was never popular. It isn't even something that I'd consider a sleeper hit. But we're going to do the thing anyway, because I liked it, I thought it was interesting, and you know what? I don't think a lot of people played through this. So, we're going to kind of do something here that you won't see a lot of other places. I'm here punching boxes, going to say hi to my dog. Hey boy, good boy! <coughs> oh, You're still getting a little bit over that cold, uh, my voice has actually recovered a lot though. Which I'm really happy about, actually. Woof woof, Coda says. All right, cool. Now, we were going to see somebody at like a festival. Oh man, I can't remember what we were doing. Let me see here. Press the triangle button. We're gonna go for information and completion. Let's see, story. I like this. I get basically a recap in case I don't remember what's going on. We're gonna escape the university. Once back in the cafeteria, we made plans to ditch school so we could attend the festival. I thought the others uh, decided not to do that. Was it uh, Makoto and his boyfriend there? We're getting out, even if we have to go through the teachers and the student body council combined. All right, so uh, what are we gonna do? We're gonna fight some school staff. I guess they're all with me. I, I noticed that they're in my party. Uh, they're probably, you know, sitting in my pocket or something. They shrunk down. They only show up for cutscenes or whatever. Um, cool. The only problem is I don't remember like the literal where to go. Oh, what do we have? We have a barricade here. <laughs> What's up with this? There's a soft hall. Oh, Atsuma, how obvious that you would try to make a break for the festival. <laughs> Why is it so obvious? We are the A3, the Anti-Asuma Alliance. Do not underestimate our spy network. A3 principles, number eight. Where there is Atsuma, there shall be A3. Your distraction to other students who would otherwise be studying. If you want to get out, you'll have to defeat us first. <laughs> Real? All right, battle time. Battle time on school property. You know, surely this is something that should get me kicked out. But you know what? I wasn't the aggressor. Hopefully it's not like a zero tolerance thing. Ha ha ha, if you want to defeat me, Atsuma, reduce my HP to zero. Let us break the fourth wall. A character with zero HP is knocked out. We call that dead. Knock out all enemies to win the battle. I don't think you were gonna reduce my HP to zero anyway. Oh yeah, I'm going to the festival. I'll defeat anyone who tries to stop me. <sighs> all right, Atsuma. Do the thing, blow him. All right, we're gonna move this guy. Uh, do we have like a way to defend maybe? No? Can I just uh, stand by, there we go. All right, now does Makoto do like magic or something? Maybe he just stays there. Gear Ballad beat Sonic. We're gonna, okay. All right, we're gonna beat Sonic back here. Sonic Blast. Yeah, sure, why not? Yeah. You ready for this? Oh. <laughs> oh, she's gonna concentrate. Oh no. Oh wow, he really screams. He really screams. Oh, okay Atsuma. You know what? Yeah, punch through both of them. Because that's actually a really good line up there. Uh, you, heal your boyfriend. Go ahead and use an item or something. Curing powder, yeah, give him some powder. And then you, Makoto, stay there, and you're gonna, wait, actually I'm a liar. Go back one and beat Sonic the heck out of them. Yeah! Oh, well, darn, I was hoping to kind of line that up. Wait, I cured myself. Okay. Oh man. I lost my guy. <sighs> well, you know what? I can just stay here. And I can... Wait. Yeah. No. Move him. Skill. High spear. Alright, he's out. I see you give up. Ooh. Ooh, that looked rough. 
Man. Toya, you know, go pick up Makoto there. He's, uh, he's looking a little not okay. Ha! No one can stop me from getting to that festival. No one. Curse you. We defeated the A3. Let's check on our party, though. Oh, cool. They just auto-recover. Except for, like, whatever, their SP and their VP here. So, uh, I wonder if I have items that'll go ahead and maybe return powder? Nope. Oh, okay. Nope. No, I don't want to... Uh, you know what? Nah! Too many menus! Alright, we're gonna go this way. So far, things are going wonderfully. I feel like we just beat the heck out of those guys. Oh, really? There's more? Are they the A32? The sequel. A3 comes back. Atsuma, you're planning something again. You won't drag our beloved Toya down with you, though. Prepare yourself. What, do they all have a fan club? Or an anti-fan club? Well, no, no, they really like Toya. The other guys hated the main character. Now, out of my way. I'll fight anyone who tries to stop me. Wild and reckless as always, Atsuma. Fool. Your EP won't last at that rate. My EP won't last. That's right, you need EP to use skills. If you run out of EP, you'll be able to use uh, oh, any skills. That's pretty bad. What can I do if that happens? You can use items or skills to recover EP or simply wait. If you wait, your EP will recover. So if you are low on EP, just select wait. Okay. Thanks for the help. I'll be careful. Oh no, I've said too much. <laughs> you will never defeat the TFC anyway. We shall save Toya from your evil. <sighs> I'm pretty sure my character is not actually evil, though, so... I, I kind of feel like they're just sort of talking out of their ass sticks here. Um, whatever an ass stick is. Uh, you know, I, I do try and keep this channel actually super, super clean. Uh, so... You can ignore that you heard anything there. Wait. Uh... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, so that takes 8 EP. And I've got 72. Alright, I got Toya to move. I can move him there, and I can high spear him. And Mokdo, Ma, Mokdo, Ma, Mukba. You can, uh, yeah, you can ballad. Beat Sonic. Okay. Yeah. Here goes. Yeah. I do kind of feel like I'm overpowered, though, for all these enemies. Oh, you know what? Makoto's not even got anyone to target. Is he gonna? Is he still gonna take his turn? Oh, now that's cool. So, um, I guess since he was actually like literally physically in front of him. That worked out. All right, so we're gonna move him up. We're gonna blow her, and yeah, you stay there. Too bad that can't be rotated. That that looks pretty cool. Uh, you know what? I can be a little safer though about things. I can go there, and I can aqua spike. Oh yes! I didn't know it would actually have that kind of a pattern. All right, Makoto, you stay there, and you beat Sonic him, and I think we've got this battle won. Man, we are just ridiculous. Why aren't we teaching the class again? Uh, you know, maybe maybe, uh, maybe they're quite a bit stronger than I realize. Tatoya! Sorry, girls. Professor Ko couldn't stop me right now. Right now. Wait, I said that twice. Alright, so we just beat up some girls. Oh, wait, is that a save point? What is that, actually? Hmm, what is this? If I call correctly, it's a recharge station. They were placed all around the world during the Golem War, and many of them still remain. It wasn't here when I was in this room last, actually. I read about them in some old scroll. Press X when close to one, and all VP lost in battle will be restored. Okay, I see. So all you need to do is press X nearby to cover VP? You picked up quickly, especially for you, Atsuma. You can use these as many times as you like, so each time you see one, go get some healing. All right, healing is great! <laughs> uh, yeah. Healing is great. We're doing the thing. Okay. Uh, you know what? I want to save it now, though. I've just gotten into, like, two battles. Uh, wait. Yeah. Okay. That's cool. I I've been known to just get kind of completely screwed over in RPGs by not saving. Right? I mean... I try to take a, a pretty good stance on that. Oh, okay, it's only 344. All right, I've got I've got some time. I can do a couple videos. This is cool. <sighs> Who are you? 
Atsuma! Oh no! I expected you to cut class and try to get out of the, to the festival. But I'll never allow that. Not while you still draw breath. Damn! The others just wanted to knock me out. She actually wants to kill me. Hey, no need to take things this far. Can we talk about this? No more talking. Pero por qué no puedes hablar? Oh wait, no, no, no. Podemos hablar. I need to speak Spanish more often, actually. Sorry, Teach, but I'm coming through. You fool, have you forgotten our attribute type of capabilities? What do you mean? I am water, and you are fire, which means we are Captain Planet. Oh, no. My attacks do double damage to you. Oh, this is gonna hurt. What? So if attributes are opposed, there's a risk of taking big damage? But hold on, double damage, huh? I guess my attacks do double damage to you too, huh? So you figured it out. No, I'm an idiot. So what? I'm a member of the staff. A mere pupil can't defeat me. Yeah, well, I've got two pupils, one in each eye, so take that. All right, so, you know, so I can pick who goes first though, right? I know who I want, what I want to do. Yeah, I want to aqua spike these guys. Now she said she's water, I know that, so that might take, like, might do half the damage. But I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna use Makoto here to beat Sonic her. And I'm gonna take him up front and I'm gonna... F I'm gonna stand Atsuma by, actually. No, that's silly. That's totally silly. I can... I can still go ahead and do some damage because I don't think Glow is probably like elemental. Yeah, I had a feeling that that wouldn't do much. Beat Sonic should be fine. Ooh, she's got a little bit extra health. Thank you. Oh, oh, oh. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay. Shoot. Uh, where's a Phoenix Feather when you need one? Uh, Toya, you're killing me. You can high spear them. That looks like it's physical. But it's gonna it's gonna hit that little wooden guy first. And Yeah, I, I don't know. I have a feeling I just wanna take her out first. She's more dangerous. Good stuff. Go. Do the thing! Will you dare attack a student? Oh man, I need to I need to let him talk again. He's pretty amusing. Atsuma, you're in big trouble. Yeah, you're the one who's knocked out. You know, she might be right. Maybe just a little bit, right? Violence on the school ground, uh, taking out teachers. But you know what? It's all good. We're going to that festival. We're gonna get some punch and, and whack some pinatas or whatever they do in this world. Maybe, uh, maybe drink some pinatas and whack some punch. I'm not really sure. I'm kind of waiting for something interesting to happen. Um, I mean, nothing like anti-interesting has happened. Oh, look at this city. That's kind of cool. You know, I actually don't really think the graphics are bad. I would say they're actually almost on par with Final Fantasy X. I'm sure someone's like, no, those character models are awful. Look at that world. Look how flat those textures are. Well, oh, okay, they're a little flat. I get it. But you know what? I don't give a care. You can't get to me. Woohoo! We escaped! All right, buddy, we escaped! What do you mean, escaped? Why do I have to cut classes and get dragged along with you? Because I stick y'all in my pocket. You go wherever I go. We're going to get in trouble for this. Uh, worry about that later. Now that we're here, let's just enjoy the festival. Atsuma always gets us involved in things like this. Let's just accept it. Oh, yeah, just you blame like me. Toya I'm a terrible says, uh, influence. Accept it. You don't get to agree with him. I get to do whatever I want. It is our duty to enjoy this festival. I can't stand here talking anymore. Let's get going. So, have you decided what to look at first, Tatsuma? Come now, Toya. What do you think? The highlight of the Yokohama Festival. You know. You know. Girls? I don't. I don't know. You don't know? How can you not know? Uh, I, I, I feel like these are all tantamount to the same thing. Uh, sure, right? Let's pick Tautology for 101. Come on, festival! That means blazing battles, dynamic dueling, frenzied fighting. What? What are you ranting on about? Stop all the shouting. 
you've lost me. I see. If I recall correctly, every year here at the Yokohama Founding Festival, there's betting on golem battles. I take it you want to get in on that, huh, Atsuma? I knew you understand, Toya, that's right. Quite unlike you, Mikado, don't you know anything? Ha! Huh, why would I know a thing like that? I want to compete in a battle or two, okay? Off you go then, as you please. If I recall correctly, the matches take place in a small tent in the square. Okay then, off to the tent we go. Ikimas, Let's go. Alright, so just checking out our environment. Okay. Pretty standard RPG fair looking kind of stadium. Pl Ooh, hey, more breakable stuff. I'm like the only jerk walking around this festival punching through what? Welcome to the pizza parlor. I'm a pizza monster. Crazy pizza his name is. Hey, <laughs> he's even got a big P at the top of his hat. Okay. <coughs> okay. We got a big pizza monster. What the heck? Funny clown. Yo, ha, hoi. Okay, they both say the same thing. Oh, more stuff to punch. Don't mind me, just being a jerk. All right. Oh, what is that? Like a mech? Examine. A city forces golem. So I'm not really clear on what golems are because they, they really do just seem to be like everything and anything. Because I'm pretty sure that pizza thing is a golem, which is kind of fantastic in its own right. Oh, mind gem. Why do people leave their valuables in boxes to be broken in a festival? I mean, at the very least, somebody could just, like, open it. In fact, why am I not just opening the boxes? No, I've got to use my fist for everything. No wonder my character's an idiot. He's just punching things. People are, like, in class with him. They wonder, what the heck is up with this guy? Harbor Boutique. Okay, that's like a shop. Well, we need to go to the dynamic battles and the whatever, the dueling banjos. We could talk to people, but there's so many people to talk to. And I know, I know it's kind of a rule in RPGs to talk to people, but... My goal is to have fun. My goal is not to play this perfectly. If I'm going to play this perfectly, I'm going to play it on my own profile, which none of y'all know about, so ha. Um, although, actually, you know, if you want to add me on PlayStation Network, we might be able to play a game together. Uh, I am int plus one on there, too. In fact, for consistency's sake, I'm int plus one everywhere. That way, it's kind of like a brand, and, you know, you can check out my brand whenever you want to. Kind of a consistent online digital presence. I like it. It does things for me. Ah, come on. Like, I got cool stuff before. Give me cool stuff. There we go. We got, I got some speed gems. Woo! I can go so fast. All right. And then I realized I didn't use it. I simply obtained it. Uh, there's another pizza place. Okay. Um, hmm. Actually, some of the aesthetics really do remind me of Final Fantasy X a little bit. It's not a bad game, though, by the way. You know, I, uh, I enjoyed the uh, the HD release with uh, a couple minor exceptions. They changed some of my favorite tracks. Um, especially the song at the top of Mount Gagazet. Oh, now that killed me. That was something that broke my heart because that was probably my favorite song Maybe next to the, um, to Yuna's summoning song. Like, that was a really nice song. I thought I could break that. I can't. Everything that's breakable pretty much conveniently glows. So, like, not only am I destroying magic boxes and barrels. Well, yeah, I'm destroying magic boxes and barrels. I meant to say, you know, not only am I destroying barrels, but, like, they glow with some kind of arcane magic. Like, I'm just a magic destroyer. I punch things with my arm. And, uh, what's this way? Is this a Coliseum? Whoa, what can I help you with? Workaholic guard? Hold on, students, what happened to lessons? Yeah. You can't laugh this one off. Well, it's festival day, I guess. Okay, let's call it a field trip, but don't cause any trouble. Now, really, do I look like the kind of guy who would cause trouble? Hmm, <clears throat> no. No, I don't. Trade district main gate. So, do I go to the trade district? I mean, how do I, uh, is the fest this is the Yokohama City Trade District front gate. Atsuma, students aren't allowed out without permission. You can get into all the trouble you like, but don't involve me and Toya, okay? 
Oh, wow. All right, so like, look at that texture. That's terrible. That is absolutely terrible. I don't even know what I'm looking at. It's like someone vomited pixels onto the door frame. Okay, that's okay. There's so many other more important things to focus on in this game, like more horrible doors. Wow. Now, how does the floor texture look so good and the door texture looks so terrible? Now, originally this was an Xbox 360 game too, right? So we really shouldn't, this should just be almost a straight port. In fact, actually, it's not even a straight port. I don't think this game supports trophies, which kind of stinks. I really enjoy trophies. They kind of show like I did stuff. Um, and in that sense, it gives me like this false sense of accomplishment. Then I get addicted to doing that instead of things I actually need to do. Ooh, more speed gems. All right. I kind of like this sort of, you know, I can, I can set it up to post automatically to Facebook whenever I do that. Which, you know, maybe I should do that. Maybe I should go ahead and uh, check that out. Set it up that way. Uh, okay. Well, I can do that later. I'm actually excited. Um, tomorrow I'm going to have a, a guest co-host with me again. The guy's been doing it the past couple, day, uh, past couple weeks with me. And uh, he's, he's going to go ahead and uh, basically be part of the near experience. So I'm really excited about that. What is this? Tent. What does that actually say? Like, Nev her a hit hoodlum step right up step right up i don't think so come on come one and all to see these golems gathered from around the world it's a freak show huh don't you want to see them fight it out head to head <laughs> yeah i want to see them no i want to fight them oh you want to take part do you yeah that's the spirit you are a student from the enchant university from the looks of you do you actually own a golem then who do you think i am of course a golem here a golem there Hey, you don't, do you? He's forbidden old golems. Far too dangerous. Okay, so I don't. Hey, you're some kind of dropout or something, are you? Sorry, kid. Sorry then, kid, but you can't take part. I understand. Duh. That's month. If I remember correctly, there might be something we can do about this. Really? What, what? Try looking at the stall next door. One shaped like an egg. Okay, the stall next door. Blue. Okay. Stall next door. Can we rent a golem? Excuse me. Is this a reception for the golem ticket tour? This is the place. Can I sign you up? Yes, but not me. Him. What? Me? Take part in what? What's this golem ticket tour anyway? You know about President Golem Company Limited. Who does business here in Yokohama City? Well, the golem ticket tour is a festival event run by them. The first hundred people to clear various tasks around the city. Oh no! And obtain four golem tickets. We'll be awarded a stunning prize. What prize? The prize is a golem for the President Golem Company. So I need to do a fetch quest. And you'll give me a golem. Cool! That's right. I'll do it! I'll do it! Sign me up now. Just don't overdo it, okay? So you're signing up? What's your name? Atsuma! Atsuma, got it. Okay, come back here when you found all the tickets. You can also get hints from the reception here too. All right, off we go. Keep an eye out for those tickets. Yes, yes. <laughs> Why do I have to do this too? Because you're in my pocket. Four golem tickets left. Okay, wait, so. Reception desk. Roll up, roll up. Kyoto City, London City, the reaches of the desert. I've seen them all and brought back these goods to prove it. All of them top quality. Buy now, regret it later. Wait, Kyoto? Who do you have from Kyoto? Show me. All right, well, what about these golden rings? Very rare work, even for Kyoto City. The ruler is very strict, so it's very tough to get these out. They're a little expensive, but you'll not get a chance to buy these any again. Any again. Again. Uh, no, all right, well, whatever. Nothing here I want. Come and take another look at me. Change your mind. He didn't even give me anything to look at before, though. That's what confuses me. So where do I get the tickets from? Do, like, are they just laying around? Should I have not punched those boxes, lest they might have actually contained the tickets before the event actually triggered them to exist? I always worry about stuff like that. You know, old games had a lot of problems with logic. Where, you know, if you did things out of order, it just didn't have these sanity checks to make sure that you shouldn't have been able to do that uh, as frequently. I guess modern games have that problem too. I know that some quests in um, 
And some of the Elder Scrolls games were actually undoable if you did them out of order. Um, and actually, when they first released Blood Moon, you could basically become, I think, permanently stuck a vampire. Or is it permanently stuck a werewolf? I mean, I know Blood Moon was a werewolf uh, DLC, basically. Uh, you know, kind of before there was DLC for consoles. Okay, so do I get to go this way now, or? Okay, no, no, all right, yep. Cool, so at least I have a limited geographic area to cover when it comes to looking for these silly tickets. So, let me think here, okay. Oh man, it's getting close to uh, to time to end this episode. So you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna stop right here. We're gonna save this, whoop, we're gonna press the wrong button first. We're gonna save this guy. And then when we come back, we're gonna look for the golden ticket. And we're gonna see what we can do. Uh, we're gonna fight some golems. Maybe we'll get a pizza monster. I want a pizza monster, don't you want a pizza monster? Let's pizza monster next time. And you know what? I really enjoyed myself. I'd like to see you back for episode three of Let's Play Enchanted Arms here at N Plus One channel. I've been doing a lot of outreach lately, and I've got some really excited, excited. Well, it is excited, but is it excited by me? I have some very exciting announcements to make um, about some partnerships, about some organizations that basically is part of why I'm doing this. Um, I haven't talked a lot about that before. I'm gonna kind of do a separate video and then, you know, it's gonna be like, you know, a, its own channel thing, kind of a bow in plus one. And, and what, what the end goal of all this is, right? A good chunk of this, you know, I'm playing video games, but probably haven't talked about what I'm raising money for and, and what I'm planning on doing with, 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 you know, with resources. So, plan on doing a lot of really cool stuff, wanna give back to the community. I want you to be a part of it. I want you to support this, I want you to give me feedback, and I wanna collaborate with people too. That excites me. I would love to collaborate with somebody. So if you're in the uh, RTP Raleigh, Durham, North Carolina area, I would love to connect. Uh, go ahead and subscribe to me. Uh, go ahead and uh, face me on the like book. I might get a Twitter. I haven't gotten the Twitter yet. Um, I do have a GitHub account, and actually I'm going to be making um, pretty much all the production files, uh, except for the raw videos, because, I mean, that's that's a lot to host. But I'm going to be making a lot of the... the program files, um, the, the Blender templates, all the custom scripts, everything, available on GitHub so you, too, can be empowered to do something like this. Because that's what I want. I want to kind of give back to the community like that. But let me not take a lot of time. All right. Thanks for joining this episode. N plus one is out. Subscribe, enjoy, and have a great day.